Oh, hey, folks, how you doing? Paul with you here today. Um, we are going to get right to it. We're going to go through the markets and we're going to get to the news and bring you up to date on what I think we should be brought up to on. Uh, Bitcoin is going up. It's at like 59,000 and change. Um, gold is at $2,514. It's up $5.50. Um, silver is at $29.58, up five cents or something like that. And um, let's take a look at the Dow. And then uh, we'll get right into the news. We'll try to make this, we'll try to speed this right along. And, um, oh, okay, here we go. Dow. Uh, 40,896, so it's up 236 points today, representing 60% uh, of 1%. It's a, you know, a good move, you know, as that goes. And uh, let's take a look at the NASDAQ. That's probably the same. Uh, the NASDAQ is up 1.4%, up 245 points. But it's different because it has a lower market cap, so... Um, 245 points for this one is up 1.4%. NASDAQ doing very well. Um, now we will check oil. And then um, that's about it. We can just get on with it. And get on with the news and get this over with. I'm sore. I threw 80 discs. Not like an approach shot, but with everything that I had. Throwing as hard as I could possibly throw. Uh, crude is down 4%. Oh, no. Um, no, I'm sorry. Uh, it's flat. It's, I, I thought it said 4%, 4 but it didn't. It's only 14% uh, percent of 1%, so nothing. So oil not moving. And now let's just go ahead and get into it. Let's get into it. Um, drudge. Sorry, folks. I am really winded. But, you know, I was going to go walking. I was going to walk, but... I don't know, you know, all, you know, I don't really enjoy walking, you know, like unless you're with somebody you love or something or your dog or whatever, it's like kind of a bummer, you know, but I'll still do it. But I was just in the mood today to go and throw my discs. So that turned out to be very good exercise. I soaked my t-shirt solid. All right, Dems Ride Momentum International Convention. Smaller crowd of protesters than predicted. I see. Harris picks ex bet boss for biopic. I don't know. What does that mean? Black Entertainment TV? Is that what that means? Downplays gender shift in strategy from Hillary. Bye bye Biden. Big week begins with farewell developing. Okay, well, don't let the door hit him in the ass. All right, and then of course. This is a very pleasant thing they're showing about uh, ex-president Donald Clinton here. Uh, the usual garbage, uh, yellow journalism. When your government or your controlling entities control what you see when you have no choice and you're too stupid uh, or don't bother caring and you're too stupid to understand one thing from another and you just do what you're told to do and do as you're expected to do. It's, it makes me so upset. You folks think I'm messing with you. I just had another person leave the channel. Uh, of course. You think that I'm lying to you? Do you think I do this for myself? When I get up here and I tell you all this stuff, believe me, folks, I don't do it to get subs. They run away because they're brainwashed sub-zombies. They don't even qualify as zombies. That's virtually all of them except my subs. Santos guilty of fraud faces six to eight years in the prison. Don't drop the soap over there. I mean, for real, okay? All right. Um, confused Trump claims Taylor Swift endorsement. Will she sue? I have no idea. Uh, Trump shouldn't say that. He shouldn't say that. That woman, uh, just from my vantage point, I don't see anything... That would make that woman uh, vote or say anything nice about Trump. She's interested in selling records and doing tours. All right? Not going against the grain. That's just the way I see it. All right. 
And of course, um, there has to be something. Like I told you, it wasn't like uh, Bite Me. When Bite Me was in there, they didn't say one thing ever. Now they're talking about Trump is this, he's in dementia, he, he's stuttering, this and that. It's just the usual garbage, folks. You're mindless, stupid sub-zombies. My subs excluded, of course. Uh, he shares fake image of Harris speaking to communist event. Love if the shoe fits where it. <laughs> um, yeah, his nephew says that the, uh, the Don there is showing signs of dementia. Let's see. It's funny, I hadn't seen him uh, shaking the hands with the air uh, lately. Paul Harris plus four. And it's true, folks. It's true. Uh, MAGA carrying Vance sperm cups. We're not going there. Use your imagination, okay? That numbskull. Uh, Texas grid faces biggest test of summer with extreme heat. It's always hot in Texas. Seems like. Uh, Manhattan DA signals openness to delay Trump criminal sentencing. Uh, let's see here. Sorry, folks. I've got these uh, flying gnats or whatever the hell these things are. They're all over. Okay, sorry about that. Let's finish this up. Okay, what does he say here? Oh, evangelicals declare Trump false prophet. Evangelicals. Uh, they declare Trump a false prophet, conservative judge. Ludig endorses Harris, of course, because he's a conservative. It's all garbage, folks. I told you, brain fucked, brain stew, sub zombies. Okay, not that it makes any difference anyway. Uh, legendary TV talk show host Phil Donahue dies at 88. He was it. I mean, in like 78, 79, 80. He was it. He was the talk show, Oprah Winfrey. And then I guess she took over or whatever. He was it. Uh, wasn't he married to that Oriental girl, that attractive Oriental girl? Or is that Mari Povich? I think Mari Povich was uh, married to Lisa Liu or whatever her name is. Uh, owning Tesla stock, not a conflict. Uh, Blinken, our good friend there, the guitarist, um, warns of, of last chance to end Gaza war. Too stupid. Hamas claims attempted bombing in Tel Aviv. Sun sets every 90 minutes. Astronaut reveals reality of being stranded on space station. Okay, we got just a couple more stories to go here, folks, and we've made it through. All right, Texas jury finds school shooters' parents not liable for violence. Um, how world sleepwalk into global monkeypox emergency. It's too stupid to talk about. Uh, if I could spit on you people, I would. If you think I'm kidding, I'm not. I try to do it by proxy all the time anyway, practically. You're mindless, stupid, sub-zombies. You're a liability. You don't mean anything. You don't count. The only thing you count for is making life miserable for those of us who know what's going on, which is a lot of us, like my subs, for example, and others. Um, all right, so we sleepwalked into the global monkeypox emergency. Well, there's another one that just died over there. Uh, yeah, he just fell down and died. Um, new loneliness cure, apps that match with strangers for meal. I got it. 
Except all mine would be like probably cats and crows. You know, this I did the news earlier. I don't think I re, I don't think I put it up, but um, I made friends with some crows here. I mean, I got to start somewhere, right? And these uh, crows are are intelligent beings. You know, they're intelligent uh, creatures. They've done tests on them and everything, and they know who's good and who's bad. And um, the worst thing you can do is piss them off and make them mad or try to hurt them. And they don't like that. They'll remember you. But I uh, had some cheese doodles, and, uh, you know, they're round balls, and they're real light, and I threw them. I threw them about five or six of them. They took them all. And um, I watched one of them eat it. And um, he kept dipping his beak into the water of the puddle and then uh, ducking his head like that and chewing a little bit of it off. And he got that whole thing down a couple times. <laughs> so it was kind of neat, you know. So I got to start with friendship somewhere, right? That's as good a place as any. A crows are very smart. And I gave them a little bit of that turkey, which I wouldn't eat either. And they seemed to like that too. They like that better, as a matter of fact. All right, let's see here. Sorry, folks. Uh, Moscow deploys, quote, space troops, unquote, to defend Kursk. I want to take a look at that. Uh, Putin warlord thanks Musk for Starlink use during invasion, whatever that means. A fragile GPS is massive vulnerability for the West, and Moscow knows it. Keep fucking with Russia. Keep fucking with them. Keep fucking with them. I'm only going to tell you, because most of you are fuck zombies. Not most of you. Virtually 99.9% .9 of you are fuck zombies. If you don't fuck, you're just zombies. Do you want what happened to the Germans in World War II to happen to you? Then stop fucking with the Russians. Leave them alone. That's my advice to you. All right, let's see. Uh, yeah, they could go after the satellites, of course. And then you wouldn't have your um, cell phones or whatever else it is. Uh, you know, folks, I'm so tired of this. This is exactly perfect for you people. Uh, and it's always the same thing, right? Uh, woman arrested for ravioli battery. Panic grows, Burning Man Festival on verge of collapse. Uh, don't they only go over there to fucking do drugs? Isn't that basically what they do? And you got the um, uh, the uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers come out there and throw a sock on their penis and come out and uh, naked and, and uh, do the whole routine. Isn't that what it is all about? And um, the um, whatever that other group is, Green Day, right? You know, I was thinking about that the other day. Uh, my sister's little girl was like a real handful, and her name was Dahlia. <laughs> and um, my mom, her grandma, uh, used to watch her from time to time. And, um, you know, my mom made real good strides to get her into private school, but my dumb shit sister, um, I don't even want to get into it, pulled her out from... American Heritage, it's probably the finest school in the land, not just here. American Heritage is the tippity top. But it was too much work for my sister, of course. And um, anyway, she came over to the, uh, you know, she would come over and she'd misbehave, you know, and talk to boys when she was 11 years old and all this kind of stuff. And um, I guess my mom, like, lit into her or something. And... <laughs> And Dahlia was like 12 years old or something, 11 years old. And, it's, you know, my mom was like pissed anyway. My mom was kind of funny. And um, that song from Green Day or whatever came on. And um, it, it's something about like, uh, I'm not perfect. And my sister started, uh, my, uh, my sister's niece, uh, my sister's daughter started singing along to mom, uh, to my mom there, her grandmother. Um, I'm sorry, I'm not perfect. And my mom went <laughs> and she caught it. And she just like whacked the shit out of her, um, which is what she needed, frankly, in my opinion. We won't get into it. 
But anyways, let's go on. These are meaningless little stories here that I'm telling. Uh, let's take a look at this thing. Uh, world's most dangerous roller coaster reaches 300 miles per hour before killing all riders. Euthanasia. Take a fake. Ride a fake. Oh, I get it. They're going to make a roller coaster that goes 300 miles an hour and then you just kind of kiss the pavement or whatever it is. Well, uh, all right. We well, don't have to worry about giving the people their money back. Oh, don't they have that Swedish thing where you get in and it takes you for your final uh, ride or something? Uh, it's like a it's like a suicide pod. Remember I showed you that before? Um, okay, let's take a look at this. Um, Ukraine strikes three bridges in Russia. That's true. And um, some uh, Russian uh, bloggers are saying that they are slowing the advance and they're blowing up a lot of Ukrainian tanks and missile launchers and, and all that. So we'll see. The problem is we can't get the truth here. I'm sorry to tell you that. You're not going to hear it because that's not the way it works. These are for the same people who retire and they're getting all the medicine they need. They worked all their life for all that medicine. The medicine's free. I uh, got free medicine our uh, whole life. See, those folks. <laughs> the people just saw me there and they're like, uh, yeah, right. Uh, okay. Anyways, folks, that's it. That's about the best I could muster for you today. I really am tired. I really, really am tired. Remember in that movie, um, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest and the guy, Jack Nicholson, is trying to get that guy to vote? so they can watch the World Series, and he's going, I'm tired, I'm tired. That's what I kind of feel like right now, that guy. All right, anyways, showing my age, that movie was a little bit over my head until recently, of course. Take care, I am pushed, truly. My body is exhausted. Take care, come back. Of course you're gonna be called a fuck zombie. Of course if you don't fuck, you're just a zombie, but lower than a zombie. Of course you're going to unsubscribe. That's part of the game. Don't think that I'm, uh, that I don't believe that you're a sub zombie and that uh, I'm doing it for exposition. I, I am not. If, if I was doing this to get subs, um, I would do something else because people leave. The, the more you go off their beaten trail of, of so-called reality, the more they see you as demonic or stupid and the smarter they think they are. So anyways, be prepared for that. We have now 134 subscribers. Thank you very much. Number 134, you probably will be back the next time you hear something that I say come true, which is frequently. Take care and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.